you know, there's four sides of different hip hop, man. What's the, I, mean, I got my man Goldie Gold in the studio. What it is. And I got the lovely lady from Lens of Life in the studio. Introduce yourself. Peace, it's Cherie Riswa. All right, you gotta come closer to the mic, bro. <laughs> I mean, you know what I mean? Come on, come on. Bring that cuteness to the mic. Uh oh. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and introduce yourself to the people. Peace, this is Cherie, also known as Reeswa, Lens of Life Photography. Uh, I wanted to make sure I got it right, you know what I'm saying? Because you shot me a couple times, you know what I mean? I did. And not with a gun, but you shot me a few times. You know it. You know what I'm saying? That's right, you know what I mean? <laughs> I always love to get shot by cuteness. <laughs> but, but you know, y'all know the four the four elements of hip-hop, you know, Goldie Gold and uh, Reeswa, you know, I should say, you know what I mean? That, did I say it right? Reeswa. 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 Mm -hmm. All right, you can beat me up later, you know what I'm saying? You can. I'll enjoy it. You can. You know what I mean? <laughs> but uh, you know, tell us about the four elements of hip hop, man, real quick, y'all. Yo, we people just get amused, man. They talk about his b boying, his DJing, his MCing, but there's another aspect that gets <laughs> overlooked a lot of times. I mean, sometimes they doing beatboxing too, right? You well, know what I mean? To the four. And so it's make it less common on me. I'm getting older, my mind. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I know it's MCing, DJing. Right. Um, breaking and graph. Right. You know now, what I mean? Now, look, uh, you, when we talk about urban art and urban art and stuff like that, that fits kind of within the, that realm of the, the urban art aspect of things, right? Yeah. Right? Right. Right? right. No, maybe so? All day. Okay. Indeed. So let's talk about what's going on with this event, the Royal Affair Art Show, that's about to take place with Reese. Wow. <laughs> All right. You so. Francois? No. Just reswap. Yeah. Yeah. Reswap. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> all right, cuteness, break it down. All right. So, I'll just call you cuteness all day. Um, <laughs> how about okay. that? All right. All right. So, um, <laughs> August 17th, Friday. All right. All you right. know, that's popping off the whole Black August weekend. Okay. That's the 33rd um, Black August event. Also, um, we have in association with that the 10th annual Happy Natural Day. So the Royal Affair event is um, is happening Friday. It's going to kick off that whole weekend, and it's happening at City of Ink, okay. um, downtown Atlanta, and Don't um, tattoo artists down there. True, true. All right, all right. From seven to ten, and um, so basically the um, the Royal Affair is showcasing showcasing um, people of African ancestry, African descent. Mm -hmm. um, basically, it's a uh, it's it's basically it's, it's about attitude. It's about our flyness. It's about where we come from. It's okay. about you know walking in um, that high self esteem and and being of that today, and also knowing that that's where you are and should be in the future. It's also you know where our kids should look. The youth need to see that as well, so that they can walk in that same light. All right, indeed. How long have you been involved with the photography thing? Doing the photography I mean, seriously. Seriously, but seriously, yeah. about 2003. 2003? So that's about, what, nine years? Mm -hmm. You're an OG <laughs> in this game. Me, you know. Oh, okay. What, what, what kind of, like, moved you to, like, get involved with photography and also push your artwork in general? Well, uh, my background is in uh, video production. Really? Yeah. Oh, okay. So, you know. Have you done videos as well? Uh-huh. Oh, okay. So let us know, you know what I mean? Let us know. Let yeah. them know. We're doing the on-air media training. <laughs> right. It's a new day, you know what I mean? About being right. shy. We ain't shrinking from nothing now here, yeah, baby. Say that. Okay. You know what I mean? <laughs> right, well, the majority of my videos that I've done... Um, happen up in Connecticut where I'm from. Okay, CT. Yes. And so um, when I did come down here, when I moved down here, I got more so into the photography, just carried that on from what I did start up in Connecticut. Okay. Um, down here, video wise, um, I did some video, mainly it was photography though, for the um, arts and beats, art beats and lyrics to go. Right, right. Dope work you did. Good thing. Great work. Yeah, Great I work. appreciate that opportunity. Yeah. Great so, work. Great thank work. you. Um, and I'm right now I'm getting back into the video, trying mm -hmm. to, you know, really marry the my video and uh, photography work. But since I've been here, which has been since like July, August of 2008, they're really going hard on the photography tips. So I'm just trying to get back to my roots. What is the biggest challenges that like photographers face in this era in 2012 because now you got like a lot of people 
everybody grabs a camera and they swear they're a photographer or a videographer or a director. Mm -hmm. You know, what are the biggest challenges in, in terms of being creative? You know, like uh, trying to find like your own creative space in an area where it's almost like DJing, where everybody now is a DJ and everybody now is starting to become a photographer. You know, how do you kind of manage around that? Well, you know, I just really got to stay true to what it is that motivates me and what inspires me. Mm -hmm. I'm really not checking for other photographers, you know, as far as what what their price points are. Because, you know, being down here, there's a lot of competition. Mm -hmm. You know, there's a lot of people, there's a lot of talented people right. um, who I can probably say are my peers, you know. Mm -hmm. um, but I really, people, people come to me because they like my eye. And, mm -hmm. um, you know, I'll shoot whatever inspires me. Mainly that's people. Um, but I'm really not focused on what others are doing or in my low ball and my pricing and everything else like that. Well, not even just from the pricing aspect, from just from an uh, artistic standpoint. Like, I, one thing that I notice about you in general, you do have a very good eye. Okay. You know what I mean? Like, because I, when I look at your work and stuff like that, I'm like, wow, you know, it's kind of like... That's kind of like what I was meaning a little bit earlier about okay. like people who take pictures. There's some people who take pictures and then it's kind of like they leave too much headroom somewhere. <laughs> but if you know it's not hard. It's like certain things, it's kind of like, uh, it's hard to explain for somebody who's kind of like from my end of things, a novice at photography mm -hmm. per se. You know right. what I'm well, well, with dealing with I, in that. In other words, how do you develop your own character out of that, you know? Well, well, it's your own your own style of photography, style, your own sure. eye. Right. You, you know, I mean, well, it's it's you gotta it's your focal point. It's also what what the subject is, you and how you want to um, draw attention to what your subject matter is mm -hmm. in that imagery. Right. You know, if you're dealing with if you're dealing with all that uh, negative space, you like what you were referencing as far as. Um, all that dead space in the picture, or that headroom. Right. I mean, is that intentional, or is it just because you can't compose a shot? Right. Okay. So, well, no max. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's the Beats and Lyrics Show, man. We talking with Reed <laughs> and my man Goldie Gold. Goldie, how do you come into play with this uh, event that's coming up, man? The Royal Fair. Did both of y'all work together to put this together, or was this entirely your idea right here, Reed? No, it was not. Um, but I am, I am grateful for the opportunity. Yeah. Uh, you know, because also by you having a city event, Tuki Carter's a pretty good photographer too. Mm -hmm. I've seen some of his work. He do photography. Know, yeah, Tuki Carter. A what? Yeah, he did stuff for like Rick Ross. He did stuff for uh, Stally, and then he did like you know just individual portraits when they did uh, went tattooing overseas to okay. Europe. You know what I mean? Because they went to Europe, you know, City of Ink went to Europe, and they actually, like, did some work, you know, artwork, or not artwork, but mm -hmm. they tattooed people overseas in Europe, and nice. Tuki took a lot of video and pictures, and I okay. thought it was really interesting, you know, on the web. Actually, I posted some of it on my blog. You know? That's what's up. Yeah, yeah, I ain't know that. I know yeah. that dude. Well, he a Virgo, so he, oh, okay. he, he can do everything, <laughs> all, you know, all day, every day. Right. But, yeah, um, yeah, we chose to do it. At the city of Ink because you know them cats is like, you know they 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 were down with the people you right, know what right. I mean and a lot of her photography is the people down here you know so it's like it's pretty much what I do with my art where I take pictures of people down here instead of you know the celebrities because right. there's a lot of people doing their thing down here right, so right. what she doing is the same thing but. With photography, right? Because Goldie, man, I see like, of course, everybody. You know, if y'all don't know, man, Goldie Gold, man, this is a, this brother, man. He, I've seen his work. I've seen his work in music videos and stuff. Oh, and I'm like, man. wow, what's that? What was the, there was something you did, man? I think Buster, that was it Buster Rhymes. It was somebody, some of your artwork was in somebody's video, man. Yeah, it was it, that Buster Rhymes. The um, the wall flux and I did for the, I think it was the first art beats and lyrics. You know, yeah. we did the wall for that, and the it wall, ended up being the wall in the video. Up there. And then also, you just see your work on a lot of different projects from different artists yeah, and yeah. stuff like that, man. Like, you're the go-to guy, man, just for, for a lot of art and stuff I like ain't that. the only one, but you know. Man, come on, y'all. I mean, but it's... Y'all it's, 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 you know too humble people, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm blowing y'all. I'm, I'm, I'm hitting the, I'm hitting the funk master flex button, y'all. Y'all just trying to be all humble about it. Nah, you know but, I mean? but you know, I roll with, you know, three the hard way, me. Flux, right. Mr. Soul, you know, them right. Mr. Be, Soul is dope. Yeah, them must be putting my original work. logo, you know. Yeah, 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 so it's like, it's, 
we we all are in our own lane, you know what I mean, and and putting in that work. So you know, I guess because of my name Goldie Gold, right. I might have a, a a small smidge of the light, but you know, them cats be killing it. You know what I mean? All right, indeed, man. Let us know once again the event and everything, y'all. Tell us about what we can expect, man, when we go, because it's a free event, man. So everybody can come out and see. We can talk about it big time. You know, it's a free event that's going down. Let us know what's going on. And Re, you gonna have to get a Twitter page or something. Because <laughs> because you do too. You, your work is actually too good to be like, you know, downplaying it, man. It's, okay. Let's 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 leave the humbleness, you know, okay. somewhere else. You know, you know. Gotta go hard. Yeah, yeah. Nelson Mandela said we shouldn't shrink for no, shrink for nobody, man. So uh, you know, just remember that. Yeah. I'm not trying to say be arrogant. I'm just, you know, but, uh, yeah. Blow it up! Blow it up! <laughs> Goldie Gold, give them the Twitter and all that good stuff, man, and we're going to, like, let them know all, all the good stuff y'all do. Well, you can. Well, we got the Royal Affair happening at the City of Ink Tattoo Shop on, um, let me see here, this is 323 Walker Street. Walker Street, Atlanta. If you're listening online, come to Atlanta, make sure you're here next week. And that's August 17th on Friday, kicking off the Black August weekend. Happy Natural Day. All right. You can find me at um, I know yeah, no Twitter. On. <laughs> no Twitter. But um, right now, there's no Twitter yet. Oh, but um, I'm on uh, Facebook. Uh, you can just uh, find me at Lens of Life, L E N S O F L I F E. We're probably going to set up your Twitter page while we're in the studio. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, seriously. Well, I also have a website, www.lensoflifephotography.com. All right, Goldie Gold, let them know the goodness. Yeah, man, I'm just, I'm here to promote her, you know oh, what I mean? Her. But the thing is, it's like, yo. Go like, gold, that count. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, but it's like, but you know, I'll I be trying to play behind the scenes, you know. I don't like put my art out. That's why, you know, even with the star videos and stuff like that, you know, like playing trying behind be, the scenes. Right. But the yeah. thing is, like you said, anybody think they can pick up a picture, take pictures and all that, right. and like, this would be a prime example for a heads to come out to the show and see how a person that's passionate and serious about photography and what they doing to see mm-hmm. how it should be done. You right. know what I mean? So I know little kids be taking pictures, bring them, you know, so they All can right. so they can feel the goodness, you know, right. like you said. So because it's like some of the pictures I've seen, a lot of the pictures I've seen are. Are crazy, you know right. what I mean, and I think it'll inspire a whole lot of people, even if they a little bit into photography or don't even or consider just, photography an art, right? Because it is an art, you Indeed. know what I mean. So this will be a great event, like you know, ladies and people just out there, man. Like you know, there's always a lot of times people always say, "Hey, let's go to uh, a movie or something like that." This is a free event, but this will be a good date night event. You know what I mean? Something to go to as well, man, and bring yeah. a date. You know what I'm saying? So it's once again, it's the Royal Fair Art Show. It's going down. Photos by Re. Wow. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Re's in the building from Lens of Life. My man Goldie Gold's there involved. It's at the City of Ink, 323 Walker Street in Atlanta. If you happen to be listening online, get your ass to Atlanta. You know what oh, I mean? Good. I tried to get my Arnold Schwarzenegger here. Get your ass to Mars. <laughs> going on. But it's August 17th. It's from 7 to 10, free admission, man. Music by our own DJ Fourth World. Shout out to Fourth World. And, um, yo, man, this would be a great event to see, man. Ree has great work. Goldie Gold has great work, man. Both of, the, both of these cats are really, really, really dope. They got to stop being humble. I told LeBron about, I told LeBron James in Miami about that. I said, yo, you got to stop being humble, homie. You know what I mean? Get this ring. Stop being humble and just get this ring. You know what I mean? But, yo, I appreciate both of you. I'm glad he took your advice. Yeah, too, man. man. What he got? He got his ring. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And a bigger headband. Right. No, <laughs> it's a comfort book. <laughs> and D. Reed, yes. Goldie Gold, I thank y'all, man, for coming yeah. through, man. It's the Beats and Lyrics Show. Hang out, y'all, man. We're going to set up Reed's uh, Twitter page <laughs> for Lens of Life right here in the studio. And uh, stay tuned, man. We're going to highlight my man Fiend in the building. He got some big news, man. He's going to share with us, man. He's been doing his thing, man. Touring all over the country, man. PA. With big cats, man, doing some big things, man. Ill lyricists, y'all already know what it is. It's the Beats and Lyrics Show. We'll be right back after this. What's up?